This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. The city of Bellevue is still seeing the effects of flooding that hit that area. The Bellevue Loop Trail has been closed due to flooding, but now could be closed for up to two years. That's because the Papio NRD will begin work on the Missouri River Levee Improvement Project. Making sure people who live downtown and those who visit stay safe will be the focus of a meeting tonight. The safety forum will be held at the Soma Gallery near 11th and Leavenworth. Omaha police plus other city and business leaders will be there to talk about plans to step up security in the area. Tonight's meeting starts at 530. And I'm 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Audrey Moore with this weather update. We're seeing a mix of some sunshine and clouds through the rest of our Tuesday. But the good news is temperatures warm back up to near 70 degrees this afternoon. So not quite as warm as we were yesterday, but still overall another beautiful day for us. And then we have some changes arriving overnight. We start to see an increasing chance for some showers, maybe an isolated thunderstorm or two. Right now, mainly looks like that will stay up to our north, but rain chances then continue to increase throughout the day on Wednesday and temperatures then start to drop back overnight. Good news if you are heading out to the Storm Chasers game this evening. First pitch at 635. Temperatures will still be in the upper 60s then. Winds will start to pick up a little bit breezy out of the southeast about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Around 9 o'clock, temperatures dropping back down into the low 60s as that game starts to wrap up tonight. Overall, temperatures are going to drop back down into the upper 40s as we start off Wednesday morning. Again, a few spotty showers are possible. The wind is also going to pick up out of the southeast around 20 to 30 miles per hour and is going to be windy over the next several days now. On and off rain chances on Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon into the evening, we could see a few isolated thunderstorms, some of which could be strong to severe. With that, main threats would be some large hail and damaging winds. Rain continues on Thursday, but it's Thursday night into Friday. We start to see that switch over to snow that continues into early Friday morning. Still not looking like a ton of snow for us here in Omaha, likely less than an inch. Things start to improve by Saturday and Sunday. Looking good for the spring game down in Lincoln Saturday afternoon. Temperatures there in the low 50s and we keep warming things up mid 50s on Sunday and mid 60s by next Monday. That's right, gang. The Godfather's going for three. The three-piece big cookie combo, that is. Get a medium specialty pie, a medium one-topping pie, and the MVP, a frosted basketball cookie. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.